Shula Mason continues to prove that he is the best prospect in boxing this Thursday on the Shakur Stevenson. Edwin De La Santos undercard. We got Abdullah Mason versus Jose Cardenas. Six round. 135 pound fight prediction. Mason, 19 years old. Southpaw fighter. Five foot nine. 74 inch arm reach out of Ohio. 10 wins, no losses. Eight wins by way of knockout. Jose Cardenas is 23 years old. 5'10. Out of Laredo, Texas. Seven foot one. Five knockouts. And let's get it, bro. Jose Cordina, man, all his fights up until this point been in Laredo. I'm mad that they just put that. Abdullah Mason done fought like six or seven, six round fight, bro. It's time to move him up to eight round fights, bro. I know he 19. I know they want to try to make sure that he develop into the star that he can be. But it's time, bro. It's time. Eight round fights, 10 round fights. 2024, I don't want to see no six round fights, bro. I think this is just a. a, a a fight to get him in the last fight of the 2023 year. I think he'll have had like four, three or four fights this year, which is good for him. Maybe it's three. Somebody let me know in the comment section. I ain't got it in front of me right now, but they done kept him real active since turning pro. And that's cool. I ain't got no problem with that, bro. But it's time to move that young man like the talent that he is, bro. He's ever been as, been as talented as your favorite prospect in boxing. Who not gonna hear him too? If you if your favorite is Keyshawn Davis, if you a Jared Big Baby Anderson guy, if you you know what I mean, if you a Tiger Johnson guy, if you a Frank Martin guy, any prospect contender and even champion, Abdullah Mason got every bit as much of talent as they got, bro. Straight up. So it's time to move him faster. But um for Cordinez, man, he ain't got near the experience, no amateur experience. All his fights in Laredo, then you got Abdullah Mason can literally do everything in the ring and he works everything behind the jab and he's long he's wiry he got good combinations and punch placement and solid defense without without um without even trying to hit hard he punches hard his transition game from offense to defense defense to offense while i'm throwing this punch keep my hand up when i'm throwing that punch he might throw this back so be ready to roll with it be ready to slip it just a phenomenally talented fighter that looks every bit of on par as being a generational talent. When you think of guys like Jerron Boutinis as a talent, you think of Shakur Stevenson as a talent, Tank Davis as a talent, um, even a Jared Anderson that people think are really talented. Like He's right there with any guy that you name. Keyshawn Davis, again, I keep bringing it up because they both at the same weight division. They both got about the same amount of fights. Everything that Keyshawn Davis accomplished in the amateurs up until being an Olympian, Abdullah Mason accomplished that too, except for he just didn't stay amateur long enough to go to the Olympics. He turned pro at 17 years old instead. But every youth national tournament, every youth Olympics, all of that shit, W, first place. He talented like that. So he comes in with a wealth of experience, and I think he's just going to bowl over uh, Jose Cordinez in a patient way, get that jab going, get that distance going, and if – Jose Cordenas is tough. Maybe it's a late stoppage or a six six round um, wipeout. If Cordenas get caught with the right shot, or if he's not tough, if he's just there to collect the paycheck, he most definitely gonna be gonna get stopped. He gonna be getting hit clean the whole time, bro. So I'm gonna pick up Dula Mason by stoppage. Just another another rung on the ladder, so to speak. Another um, step in the right direction in in his um in his growth. Um, but just you know. This is a fight that you'll watch If you just, you know, like me Want to see great talent on display Because you're going to see the speed The length, the athletic ability The fluidity um, with the movements The different angles And just um, the creative things that Abdullah Mason Is able to pull off in that ring at, at such a young age, man It's a sight to see So I got him by stoppage like round four, round five I think going to soften him up a little bit And in in his knockout ratio At 19 years old Having an 80% knockout ratio, even though they have him in there against guys that he's clearly more talented than, you can only imagine that as he grows into being a, a man and gets at 140, gets to 147, when his frame, 5 foot 9, 74 inch arm reach, when that frame fill out with the shots that he's able to hit you with, 
Good night, bro. Good night, bro. We got Abdullah Mason by destruction. So it's a five minute video. It's a short ass video. Cause it's gonna be a short ass fight. And it's a short ass fight. Cause even if it go to distance, it's only six rounds. But I got it even shorter than that. Cause I'm picking Mason by stoppage. Y'all let me know who y'all got. Comment below. Smash it like I see y'all soon. Peace out.